Welcome back to my channel. Google's Nano Banana, Explain 2025. Introduction In 2025, Google unveiled a new artificial intelligence tool called Nano Banana, despite the quirky, almost silly name. Nano Banana represents a serious leap forward in the world of image editing and generation. It is powered by Gemini 2.5, Flash Image, the latest AI model, developed by Google DeepMind, and it allows anyone from casual smartphone users to professional designers to create, edit, and remix images with nothing more than a few words typed into a prompt. But what exactly is Nano Banana? Why is it important? And how is it? Changing the way we think about images and creativity. Let's break it down in detail. What is Google Nano Banana? Nano Banana is the Cody name for Google's high image generator and editor. It lives inside the Gemini app on mobile and web and is also available through the Gemini API and Vertex AI for developers and businesses. The name Nano Banana came from a teaser by Google CEO Sundar Pichai, who mysteriously posted three banana emojis on social media before the tool's announcement. Internally, the bananas were a playful Cody name for the new feature, and the nickname stuck. Now, when people talk about Nano Banana, they're really talking about Gemini 2.5 Flash Image, the underlying AI model that powers it. In simple terms, Nano Banana lets you tell AI what you want an image to look like, and it makes it for you. It can also take existing photos and edit them quickly and intelligently. Key features Nano Banana isn't just another image generator. It brings together several advanced features that make it stand out from previous tools. 1. Natural language editing. Users can upload a photo and type something like make it sunset, add a cat on the sofa, remove the background, the AI understands and applies, the edits instantly no need for masks, brushes, or Photoshop skills. 2. Multi-image fusion. Nano Banana can take two or more photos and blend them into one seamless composition. For example, you could combine a picture of yourself with a landscape, photo, and the AI will generate a realistic image where you appear inside that scene. 3. Identity consistency. Perhaps the most groundbreaking feature is keeping subjects recognizable across edits. If you upload a selfie, you can ask the AI to change your outfit, put you in a different city, or even turn you into a cartoon character, but your face remains distinctly yours. This multi-turn editing allows continuous transformations without losing identity. 4 fast and accessible. It's called flash for a reason. Edits and generations happen within seconds, and the app is designed for everyday users, not just professionals. 5. Watermarking and safety. Google built in synthed watermarking, both visible and invisible, to mark all high-generated images. This is meant to make AI outputs traceable and reduce risks of misinformation or deep fakes. Why Nano Banana matters, the importance of Nano Banana isn't just about flashy tech, it's about how it democratizes creativity. For casual users, people can quickly make fun edits, create memes, design social posts, or improve selfies. For professionals, Designers and marketers can create product, mockups, advertising visuals, and brand content without spending hours in Photoshop. For developers, 
the Gemini API. Let's apps and services integrate Nano Banana into their own workflows, extending its reach. Within just days of its release, Nano Banana attracted over 10 million new users to the Gemini app and processed hundreds of millions of image edits. That kind of adoption shows how hungry people are for tools that make creativity easier. Everyday use cases, here are some examples of how Nano Banana is being used right now. 1. Social media fun. People turn their selfies into comic strips or figurines. Viral challenges have emerged, where users prompt the AI to place themselves in wild scenarios as astronauts, medieval knights, or anime characters. 2. Photography and personal edits. Quick background removal or replacement. Adjusting lighting, weather, or time of day in a photo. Trying out new hairstyles or outfits virtually. 3. Business and marketing. Brands use it for product. Photography mockups. E-commerce companies create consistent catalog images without expensive photo shoots, startups prototype logos, ads, and campaign visuals rapidly. 4. Design and architecture. Interior designers can visualize how furniture looks in a space, real estate agents can stage rooms with different decor styles instantly. 5. Education and entertainment. Teachers create engaging visuals for lessons. Game developers prototype characters and scenes. Storytellers illustrate concepts quickly. Benefits and advantages. Speed. Complex edits take seconds instead of hours. Simplicity. Anyone can use it regardless of design skills. Cost savings. Small businesses can skip. Expensive photo shoots. Consistency. Characters and people remain recognizable across edits. Integration. Works within Gemini. Social media. Like X and developer platforms. Limitations and concerns, even though Nano Banana is powerful, it's not perfect. Basic tools missing. Some users noted it can't perform. Simple actions like cropping to a custom aspect ratio surprisingly basic compared to traditional editing software. Deepfake risks, the ability to preserve identity so, while well, also raises fears of misuse, since bad actors could create convincing but fake images of real people. Editing degradation. After many rounds of editing, some images start to distort or lose detail. Dependence on watermarks. Although images carry visible and invisible watermarks, determined users could still crop them out or attempt to remove them. Public reaction. Nano Banana has been called a Photoshop killer by some media outlets because it brings professional-level editing to ordinary users. Tech writers describe it as both exciting and worrying. Exciting because it makes creativity more accessible than ever. Worrying because of the potential for ultra-realistic deepfakes. At the same time, the fun branding Nano Banana has made it more approachable and shareable. It feels less like a corporate AI tool and more like a playful assistant. The future of Nano Banana. Nano Banana is just a beginning. Google is already positioning Gemini as a central hub for multimodal, high not just text and images, but also video, audio, and code in future versions. Nano Banana could support AI video editing and generation, allow real time augmented reality filters, integrate more deeply with Google Workspace for presentations, docs, and marketing. As competitors like OpenAI, Adobe, and Meta release their own tools, Nano Banana is Google's way of staying ahead in the AI creativity race.
Conclusion. At its heart, Google Nano Banana is a creative equalizer. It gives everyday people the ability to edit and generate professional quality images just by typing what they want. It blends fun, practicality, and powerful AI into one tool that feels almost magical. Of course, with that power comes responsibility. The same technology that lets you put yourself on a magazine cover could be abused to spread misinformation. That's why watermarking, regulation, and ethical AI development will be crucial. Still, there's no denying it. Nano Banana changes everything by making image creation as simple as writing a sentence. Google has redefined what it means to be creative in the digital age. Thanks for watching.